anywhere. Yeah, I think uh, Kyo was uh, like the main remaining. starter of that build in NA. He'll he'll go like Ag or, uh, Ags into Five like a Crystalist remaining. into a Satanic. Uh, a little bit of discrepancy between Garacopter and the PL, but I don't think that's too big of a deal. Uh, but I think whenever you're playing the Slaughter Darkseer, you really want to be punishing the safe lane. If you're not able to do that super early on, then now, up your rotation. He's down to the third. He's down to number one. This will be first blood for the top lane in favor of Team Steve. Aggressive. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna back up the match and make sure I don't drop. K K2 is... is Lane to be a safe laner. Pilot Eye might have been the one to get the kill. But they have the X constantly to try to perform the line. So it's Pilot Eye again who takes the kill. Yeah, that's uh, a nice couple of turnaround kills, and they don't even lose their tier 1 tower, so if Pada TP's back down here to farm, then Secret knows that his Garacopter is trapped here. They could potentially rotate on him if he goes to another lane, then Keizu will have absolute free farm bottom, attack. so Something those two turnaround attack. kills are like super huge to force Pada to make a break. Is he getting that? Yeah, he is! <laughs> no, okay, he's denying the cap. Dyer's top tower. Yeah, he is kind of trapped here now. For us, may look to try and burn him a little bit. He's starting to get slowly chipped down, but still has Doppelganger. actually awarded the kill as well in the mid lane. Wait, hang on. I think I think I think I, I think he got flagged. <laughs> and a fall. Teams have potential to take these early fights. A lot of it is just about how the moves are made. No mana. It pulls mid one out to safety, but he still wants to go back there and rejoin his teammate. MP's on the run for Ep with burning him in the tree line. It's like it was creating more space than anything else on a way. Like Vera's gonna show himself here. And, uh, and he'll understand that uh, Bear's has some defense in the mid lane. Sunstrike thinking he's gonna kill I kind of forget that Sunstrike is always able to do a whole lot of damage from very, very far away. And MP being able to fight up to Dark Sea a little bit more damage pumping. He's gonna fall off. They've got extra balance for some black holes. They really want to commit it. Hasn't happened just yet. Bumpy, all of Rep's just all in. Bada, they're trying to clean out the line. Oh. We got the instant stun! The second big one went in there, he got the crush on him! Yeah, he had the haste rune. I don't know how mid one always has a haste rune. It's kind of... Yeah, and, you know, the fight's like that. Yeah, he's playing a little bit scared on Fado, which I think is smart. He doesn't want to get jumped to my mid one, who's off the map right now. He can always be rotating from the shrine, although... Radiance they have a, they put up another attack. ward? Okay, no, so they can't actually see this shrine. Yeah, he's actually keeping onto the creep. I'm gonna look for somebody. Yeah, looking on that first creep, but the relocate down, they find Fresh and Freeze. He actually wants to go over, okay, back, all. No DP control available at the moment, but Fresh has to come over to accept his fate. With a PL illusion, he's almost killing Pylite Pi. Pylite Pi's relocate will end up saving him. And they got us up, but Finn was happy to reveal himself. The gap's so with him. 
Oh. Yeah, it is kind of hard to hit a black hole though against uh, various heroes. You know, the Gyrocopters you go for aren't typically in the same area of the fight. They have the Slaughter and the Dark Seer that are going to be jumping in and casting themselves and then just sort of running around trying to do it again. So it's not the easiest you know, game to find a good black hole. And there isn't a target they necessarily want to solo black hole. They could just. Aegis! Here comes Kaiser! Three man for the black hole! He managed to find it! And now with the control, Gyro will fall down! They do have the Aegis Demortal, that's what's going to allow him to come back to life again. There's no one for him just to be by four heroes. There's no way Fata can survive. MP with a double kill. And they're not done yet. Adam is on the run. He'll be a consolation prize. Too easy. Triple kill for MP. Those fights are sort of just like the difference between, uh, you know, what, what ends up happening with these networks. Garacopter and Booker up on top, but the Lion just so poor. The Slaughter only having a Blink Dagger. Yeah, I think Bears is, is considerably more reliant on getting the jump. I think Secret, even if uh, you know they don't really have to get the jump, they can sort of have the Ember run in, start bolusing people, and they'll always have this Enigma waiting in the wings, ready to potentially black hole. They have the Rubik, they can lift someone. Bears, like, they really need to go in with this Lion and the Slaughter and blow up here, because if they don't, then they're just food, because they've already blinked in. They get, you know, chains. Rubik lifts them up and they just get completely evaporated. They have to fuse a blade to bring him down as well. Where secret supports are very, very hard to kill. Pilot dies sitting at 1500 HP, has the Lotus Orb and Ogre Club. You know, Puppy has the Force Staff now as well as the Sword Crust and Blink. A 10k net worth of both supports compared to 10k between both of the pairs. Puppy jumps in between here on the Invoker. More support from the neighborhood. Aizu makes that right opportunity for the Sentry Ward down to kind of hide inside the Invis. But Yankee all the time moves to see what's been like. He's got a Shadow Blade to get him. Team Secret actually deep beat out, so that's why I'm really engaged on the... And then he's getting straight land. And in fact, this is more of an engagement. Rubik is summed up against Rob Kane. Here comes him with the Black Hole. Oh, he's got a couple of minutes. He's more about one life. And they just like great steps for the making the Marines out of it. Third jump forward. They want to do a double. Four feet dragged in with the lineup. He's going to be there. Now it's filling up. The Fearer, if he can really turn this around. Looking for the kill on this one. There's no real man. The Deathly Class. Highlight Die is the lifeline. MP will get the double kill. Moving down to Prevent a little bit further to the south. But Invoker, run away. This is not the fight for you, or is it? And now it's Fearer who's able to run. He's going to pay for the target. It's going to be close to Rubik. Look at me right now, but now maybe they will divide the Yeah, and whatever you're, you know, you're so committed, you have these, the Slaughter, the roof, the, the Lion, like we talked about, you have to jump in and jump these heroes, and the Enigma is just always waiting in the wings, looking for an opportunity. If you mess up your positioning for just one moment, they get, you know, three, four-man black hole, really nice for Keizu, and now only one buyback on the Garakopter. They may lose two and even three sets of racks. 
Yeah, you can even just get bottled up in the base, and you know these supports are unlikely to get any more items as the game advances. Zero's gotten up to the Octarine course. Oh, Pumpy's back to the line, and we're gonna stop Pumpy and make it down soon. He's pretty low, but here comes the Black Hole again. Hey, Zero, take off the Dara, take off the Inverka, the two big ones, they'll find the kill. Inverka, where's your buyback? You'll have it available. Hey. Chug, 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 chug. We'll keep pushing through. Down to Perev, who retreats back inside the base. All the way to the fountain. So Gyrocopter is down, but they didn't lose any more. That was Black Hole number one. Black Hole number two is available, but without the BKB. Yeah, and I don't really know what Bears can do. They all have fodder to run into them. Bam out here and there. Some random spells, but it's done. So they have Flight, they have Doppelganger. They just have to keep chipping the Gyro. Wait for the timing. There's your buyback. Call snap over. Then keep the Doppelganger Tanker quickly away. Adam with the extra sun. Catch the eye of the ball. Sticking on the back line. Sun strike on the Ember Spirit. Highlight eye. BKB. Trying to protect this one. Able to do so. But Gyro comes up. Kind of trapped a little bit on the front line. He wants to bring back out again. The Fury changes the ball to the gear. With the cooldown as well. Space will be created. Wait. You're actually throwing out a tornado catching Highlight Eye. They remove the IO nuisance. Which is, can they do much more? Remember, Roshan is still up. Team Secret did not take him. The pilot Knight has buyback, and now with the Sun Strike, they scout the fact that Roshan is alive. But there's issues on bottom lane. The Creep Wave is now attacking the Tier 4 tower. Radiance middle tower. They want to go in for this, they got to go in hard. Yeah, at the very least, the Tier 4s have the regen now. Here, cycling through spells. Debating whether to go in or not. It is kind of risky coming into here. They could potentially get black hold, and they're really worried about that. Maybe trying to bait secret in, flanking into the pit, and then kill them after they've jumped in. Something they could maybe go for. Or I have actual TP's back to the base, so you know, make sure they get the creeps off of these towers. I gotta cut the mid lane. Puppy. The puppy on the wrong side of the river. He'll go down and actually gives over the gem. I say he gives the gem back to Yapsor. Oh, the particle effects, they've started. Forev is got a halo. <laughs> oh gosh, fada has got a halo too. What the hell is that? It's happening so fast. What the hell is that? Back into the fight. The fighting of a road gun. Fada will drop. Here goes your beat. Your beat can be a black hole. The hold in two. The Invoke is gone. The Gyro is gone. The Gyro will have buybacks. Yamsun has to jump himself away from this fight. It's Invoke. He'll buy back quickly. But the Aegis the Immortal ends up into the hands of Mid One. <laughs> and yeah, Darkseer has just gone glorious. Yeah, with no bad buyback on the Gyrocopter, it's almost definitely going to lose these racks here. Don't worry, the game is still an alpha. Alpha game. Mid one comes forward. There's a Siri chains over on the Evoker. They're trying to hold him here, puppy to help out. But for him, Gapsol, nice truck, but here we go again. Another black hole. Hold him in position. The Darks here are in Slana. They're going down the drain pipe, but they're not dead. They're still alive. The life is there. The Sun Strike and the Finger are dead. He'll hit the mark. The infantry will drop the PLs down. Buyback is available. The oh. Fear is moving in attention over towards the Enigma. He's brought him down too. They still hold the rack. The mid one. How much damage is left in the tank for the Ember Spirit? Truth back up and alive. Inverka fighting the team for talent. Highlight die is still being an absolute nuisance. And MP is finally moved for Jake Smith Gaming. Taking on the top rack. Yapsol with the sun. The range is still alive. It's the only thing we can send between Ben and the Mega Troops. With the fact, in the tornado, a triple kill for MP is the win. The Vogue Fear and Daphne Plus is still not enough. The tease is there. The regeneration is there. They're backing out. Ember Spirit. He'll get the series chains off. Down from the meteorite. Down. And a thing you've got. What's left there? Finger of Death is up, maybe that's the jump. They can kill on Highline Die with that one. With the sun, with the hex, Yapsor, he'll get the sun off. They're draining out the mana. Mid one is low, the finger of death will do his job. Adam barely survived. The blame almost killed him. Please stay on the front line. Keep the hex up. MP turns around too. Lion will fall. Highline die in the neighborhood. His Voker is down. It's only Slada and it's only GG. 55 minutes. The game will belong to Team Secret. Holy crap. Incredibly noble defense, uh, considering the, the deficit they were in.
gold, the Gyar Copter being down, and they just march towards the base as well with the Aegis. To defend for that long, but Secret, the, this Enigma pick ended up just paying off massive dividends. They really didn't have an answer for it.